What's up guys, I'm Caden with Crypto Now or Never. Today I'm back with an update on Miggles. Please do me a favor and hit that like and subscribe button. Help me pump that algorithm, I'd greatly appreciate it. None of this is financial advice. Let's get into it. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and belief. Know what I want. All right, so at the current moment, the crypto market has actually had a very nice recovery. It was only a couple days ago that Bitcoin was down at 49,600, and now it's back above 60,000. And I believe Bitcoin actually reached around 62,000. Yeah, it reached 62,729. So yeah, that is a very nice recovery. And just to show you guys the Crypto Fear and Greed Index, we are all the way back at neutral. We were just at 20, which was extreme fear yesterday. It is insane to see how fast the sentiment can change. But in this case in particular, I understand completely why it was extreme fear and how it has completely changed. Because purely from a technical analysis standpoint, I don't think we looked very good at all. If you look at the four hour time frame, I was warning everyone about how we looked like an inverted cup and handle. I'll flip over the chart so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But it looks like we were about to come down, get a bounce off of the 21 day, and then have a nice pump to the upside, except it would actually be to the downside. And we ended up breaking right back beneath the 21 day, then out of nowhere, we just had this massive explosion. So in this case, technical analysis did not play out at all. But anyways, at the current moment, we'll go ahead and give it another try. So right now, again, the four hour had a very nice pump to the upside. However, we got rejected off of the 200 day moving average. As I say in almost all of my videos, this is an extremely important level. In order for me to be bullish on a lot of altcoins, I need to see us get back above this. Now, at the current moment, the RSI and stochastics are both extremely overbought. So it would make sense if price action started to flag out and then it potentially got a bounce off of either the 50 day or the 21 day. Both of them could work as a support level. Now, I do also want to show you on the hourly time frame, we are above the 200 day. So there's also a chance that we do get a bounce off of this 200 day. And the stochastics are extremely oversold with bullish divergence on the RSI. So the one hour does look very good. And then the daily looks very strong. That is a huge candle close. Now, yes, we have had a little bit of a rejection and it closed just beneath the 200 day, similar to the four hour. Yet again, this is an extremely important level to get back above. But again, after the flash crash, you cannot complain about this candle that was very bullish and it was out of nowhere. So the main thing I recommend you guys watch is the 200 day moving average on the daily and the four hour. That's going to give you a much better idea of the direction that we are going to be heading in the short term. But now we'll go ahead and take a look at Mr. Miggles. And right now you can see Mr. Miggles has actually had a very nice recovery, similar to Bitcoin. We had our low, we had our local high, then we had a higher low, then a higher high. So this could be the start of an uptrend. And if you guys don't know about Mr. Miggles, I've talked about Mr. Miggles once on my channel so far. But basically Mr. Miggles gained a lot of traction because out of nowhere they ran up to about $114 million market cap. And that all happened within three days. And a lot of people believe that a big reason for that is because of Coinbase. As you can see right here, if you look at the Coinbase Twitter, which has 6 million followers, they have Mr. Miggles as a pinned tweet. Now, I will say it's not like they're actually promoting the token. However, Mr. Miggles is pinned, which could be very bullish. And a lot of people think they're doing this to bring a lot of volume to base chain. But one thing that I do want to point out, just because I've had it pointed out to me by a lot of different people, is a similarity to Rocky. And I want you to understand that there is always a chance that this ends up the exact same as Rocky. Because a lot of you guys probably remember this project as well. It ran up to about a $65 million market cap in like a week. And at this point, it's all the way down to a $514,000 market cap with basically no volume. So I just need you guys to understand that there's a chance Miggles does that as well. But again, what I do like to see from Miggles is that it is showing strength while Bitcoin is showing strength. This is the first higher high we have had since the pullback. So if Bitcoin can keep the momentum, then we could get a nice pump to the upside. I will say in Miggle's case, it has already doubled because it fell down to about a $13 million market cap. Now, if you look at the Miggle's X account, they are growing very nicely. They're up to 33.6 thousand followers. And compared to a lot of other meme coins, they actually get very good engagement on their posts. But at the end of the day, it's not like Mr. Miggles is some upcoming AI project. I'm not trying to convince you that the technology is amazing. I just simply want to make sure this is on your guys' watch list. Because if Coinbase is actually pushing Miggles behind the scene, then this could explode. But while we're on X, you guys should come over and give your boy a follow, at Crypto Now or Never. I post on here pretty much every single day. And then I would also like to take a moment to talk about my private Discord through Patreon. So at the current moment, I have three different tiers, and there are many benefits to joining my Discord. For example, this is going to give you guys closer access to me. You guys are going to be able to track the cryptos that I'm personally buying, selling, considering buying, and even the cryptos that I currently hold. And we have been making some huge gains in here. For example, I first called Mr. Miggles at a $17 million market cap before it ran up to $114 million. 
And then I also posted a buy alert for Hoppy at a $580,000 market cap. And Hoppy ran up to over an $87 million market cap. That is over a 100x. Just to put that in perspective, if you guys had invested $1,000, your $1,000 would be worth well over $100,000. So if this is the kind of thing that sounds interesting to you guys, I have the link right here on my YouTube homepage. We're building a very strong community. I'd love to see you guys in here. But as always, I want to be crystal clear, every single one of these projects that I cover on my channel comes with extremely high risk. It is very important that you always understand your own risk tolerance. But that's about all. Let me know down in the comments how high do you guys think Miggles will go this bull run. If you found this content valuable, please do me a favor and hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your day.